Okay, in this short video, we will look at how to use our Casio calculator to solve a system of two linear equations. So, all what you have to do here is go to mode, this button here, click it, then 5 for equation, you need this, you put 5, and then you need the first one, this a n x plus b n y equals c n, so you need 1. Okay, and then you will get this a b c and then 1 2. Here you will enter your equation as a x plus b y equals c. The first equation, then the second equation. I will remind you of something. Let's go back and uh, I, to make it easy for you, I call it the mode 51. So you click mode, then 5, then 1. Now you are there, so it is kind of an easy way to remember it. Mode 51. And now enter uh, the coefficients of uh, the two linear equations. So let's say the first one was x plus y equal, let's say, uh, 120. And then uh, the second one, let's say it's 0.85x plus 0. 40y equals, let's say, 0.62 times 120. Maybe this is reminding you of mixing problems. Uh, it's on purpose. I put it like this so that you see that you can even solve a mixing, mixing problem uh, on this calculator immediately. And once you enter the last one, put equal again and look what happens. When you put equal again, it's giving me x and y. Put equal, you go back. So put equal again, get x, then y. This is the solution to this linear equation. So now I want to make all zeros and just show you the other two cases. You know, the case that you just saw is the independent system where you got one solution. So I will show you again. Let's say that you have 1x plus 2y equals 10. That's the first equation. The second one is, let's say, 2x plus 4y equals uh, 21. Now look when I check. This system has no solution. The two lines are parallel. So look, equal, no solution. It's telling you already. This is because you see, 1, 2 in the first one, and then the second one, 2, 4. It's a multiple of 1, 2. So the two lines are parallel now, and then you look here, and you see that the two numbers don't match. If, uh, if you want the second equation from the first equation, you multiply by 2, but you don't get it exactly. And that tells you that uh, it's, uh, the two lines are parallel and never intersect. Now, if you change this 21, and to just put it 20 instead, then the second equation becomes two times the first one. And so if you put equal again, infinite number of solutions. So you see one number only made uh, the difference. But of course, it could be anything. You know, now, whatever you have, if you have, for example, 2x minus 3y equals 8, and uh, 1x minus 5y equals 12, for example, equal. Now we see, what case do we have? We press equal. Ah, x and y can be solved. So this is the independent system case. So x is 4 over 7, and y is negative 16 over 7. So it's nice to know that you can solve, using this calculator, any system, and you saw the three cases. The independent system where you have one exact solution which is like this one and you saw the case where maybe I do it quickly uh, one for example one one two and then two two three this example you don't have any solution so when you put equal it tells you no solution so the two lines are parallel and never intersect and the last one is when we have um, for example, the second equation here, let's say if we have 4, then the second equation is like a multiple of the first, so they are the same line. So this means an infinite number of solutions, as you can see. 
So I hope that this video helped you uh, understanding how to use your Casio calculator to solve systems of linear equations.